Okay, I'm starting late tonight, another less than an hour before Easter Sunday. Um, I just got an $8 order that popped up for Wawa, the gas station. Um, so I'm going to go there. I think I'm going to stay in my area tonight. You got your blanket, Lonnie? Mm-hmm. Check. Ready? Yep. Let's go. We got to go to Wawa. All righty, y'all. I have arrived to Wawa. If it's a long line, I'm going to do what Cheryl told me to do, who commented on the last video. She was like, girl, forget that. It ain't ready. And he got to wait till the line go down before he could fix your order. Let somebody else doing DoorDash, too. There go her bag. Um, I'm get in line. They better take me next. Um, oh, I got to see what name it is. I need to click arrive to store. I forgot to do that. So this is where I would typically come. I mean, typically come to pick up DoorDash. I would come right here. It would be over there, but at the moment we just push back. So okay. You would come right here to me. Okay. Okay. You, yeah, you just be on the right back there. Okay. You think it's over there? Yeah. Oh, you're making it now? Okay. Thank you. Sorry for the way you No problem. Before I can even get to the car, another one popped up for Wawa for Larry S. Let's see if it's already ready. Uh, I'm, and I just said that I probably can't have no stops in between. Larry S. What's up? Uh, Larry S. I, I we are still working on all these different orders right now. So when they are completed, he's gonna put them up on the rack over there. Okay, because I was told if I get in line, then I would have to be service first. Since that situation happened yesterday. <laughs> That's what I was told. I don't know. And it does help. Because she got ice cream, so it I can't. It helps, especially if I got big line. Right. But I do ask what he's actually, actually working on putting that. So where is he together. so I can let him know? He's putting it all together. You're actually over the drink station right now, actually. Okay. Because I didn't even get to the car and the other one popped up, so. Okay. It's the one that he just gave me. She has ice cream, so I definitely don't want her to. Larry is. Are you sure it's not that one on the rack over there? I tried to look, but I couldn't really read it. I'll check again. You can go ahead and take care of them. Excuse me. Ain't this Jarrell? Hey, Jarrell! <laughs> it's all right, yeah. Uh, no, that's Aaliyah C. Not Larry S. I could unassign from it if I want, but... I see you doing DoorDash too. Yeah. How long have you been doing this? This is my third night, and this, this is my second. For real? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah. This is kind of crazy for when we come to these stores because, like, they're they're never ready. Exactly. I came here last night too, and the really? person stuff who I got in the car, they have ice cream. Uh, so I'm like, yeah, I'm not where's? <laughs> I know we can unassign it if we want, but I'm just yeah. trying to accept all of them right. since I just started. Exactly. You know. I'm in the same boat. Yeah. So this is my first time. Well, every I've been here. A couple times today, but it's just been like it's already been ready for it. I never waited for like live. Really? Yeah, that's my first time. But McDonald's gets like this. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm not doing McDonald's yeah, anymore yeah. because yeah. they let me sit through the drive-through 20 minutes last night. Oh, and so God. the second time when I came back, I knocked on the door because the inside was closed. So I knocked on the door. I'm like, it's right there. Like it's and she unlocked the door and handed it to me. Got the code and everything. But who? Oh, for real. <laughs> <laughs> you talking about her? Yeah, he's switching the ice cream for me. I appreciate it. Okay, hold on. You just took the bag out your hand. It was funny how you was looking at him like, um, he's switching the ice cream for the first time. I was gonna ask that anyway, so I'm glad he did. What's that? You gotta weigh it. You weighing that? That's a weight? Oh, okay. I mean a scale. I said, is that a weight? A 
That's why he's taking his precious time, honey. I just gave you a new ice cream. Okay. Appreciate it. And I'm glad you're retaping it, too, so they don't think I opened it up. But the other one is almost done? What? Are, they got hot food or something? Um, They got hot food. The hot food is done. She just got to look at drink. Okay. And I'm making sure you, yours is right next. That's I hope why I'm so. staying over there. Because this is going to be my other cutoff point. I said I'm not going to McDonald's anymore, and I'm probably going to stop coming here, too, because it's, it's, yeah. I'm missing orders and money, like just sitting here waiting. So, and I yeah, I get it. I appreciate it. I'm sorry. No problem. No problem, baby. I was about to say you damn sure is, but no, I gotta I gotta get in good with some of these people, especially at McDonald's. I know a few people there, but some of the locations I don't know people there, so I gotta get in good with them, honey. So I can come on and slide to the back door and get my delivery. He got a freaking burger and a smoothie. Excuse me. Do you know how much longer it's gonna be for Larry's order? He got a burger and a smoothie. And I'm here with DoorDash. Larry S. He got a burger and a smoothie for DoorDash. Like he's changed his ice cream already once for another order. He's gonna have to change it again. Like this is ridiculous, huh? No, I've been waiting for him. The guy in the vest. Yeah, he hasn't made. He only made one order, and that was three pints of ice cream. But it's gonna be melted. There he is now. I don't know if he has them or not. This is Larry S. He only got a burger and a smoothie, right? Ooh, honey, thank you. God damn! I could have made the damn burger myself. I could have went home and made the damn burger myself. No, you laughing, but I'm serious. It shouldn't take that long. Like, when people got orders and they got to deliver it, make that shit, have it ready. I'm, I'm mad, you know, because it's my time and money, but I'm also mad for the customers. They shouldn't have to wait on their stuff that long. I hope her ice cream don't be milk. Who is that? Huh? Who is that? Oh, hey, girl. How you doing? Call me. I got to go because I got to take these orders. Okay. Oh, you know what? I got you. <laughs> so I finally got to my first stop at 11.45 and I'm on like a major highway. Alana, you could come with me so I can show you how to take the picture. She asking, can she come up here? I got my hazards on. It's right off a major highway. Get the ice cream. The ice cream, just the ice cream. See, you got to give somebody else food. Hey, you're going to learn how to do this and you get us somebody else wrong food. Okay. Hold on. All right. So it's done. Let's go. She took me five bucks. So sweet. Now let me get off this main road because I hope ain't nobody drinking and driving, honey. And it's Easter. Let me hurry up and get it. Woohoo! <laughs> I can make that. Ah! Okay. Child, we just passed McDonald's and I told Lonnie, nothing better not pop up while I'm passing McDonald's because I'm not getting it. And Alani was like, D D line. She don't even know. But yeah, that line was wrapped around the building when we just passed. I meant to go today. I just need to pick a time to go in the daytime to see if I could talk to somebody, butter them up, and let them know, hey, I need you to open that side door when I come. It doesn't make any sense to sit through a line for 25, 30 minutes and it's already done. Like, I probably need to call McDonald's corporate by that. I think I'm gonna do that. I might be the one to start this movement for DoorDash, okay? So, we're on to the next one. I'm like about one and a half miles away. Because when I started this recording, it said 1.9 miles. So we'll be there in a minute. It said I was six minutes away. So not far for both deliveries. No, you're going to do it by yourself. You go up there and you're going to hit complete delivery steps. I'm going to show you right now. Alani's about to do this one, y'all. And when I got to 25, 29.09 or whatever, it said I was here. It's 29.01. Okay? So let me show you what to do. It's zero tip. And Alani told him to have a good day. And I'm correcting her, telling her it's nighttime. Yeah, you have a good day. 
zero tipper so i think when it said three dollars i think that's base pay this is a dead end so i gotta turn around and somebody property i'm sorry y'all please don't shoot my mama used to always say that when we have to turn around in somebody's driveway like don't shoot don't shoot i thought you said i had another delivery lonnie it was vibrating mm -hmm. okay let me see what it is because i don't feel it vibrating and i'm so glad it's not let me not bring it up what the hell I ain't even see him. It looks like he had a bow and arrow in his hand. All right, let's get on to the next one. Um, we was, when we was on this road, like a block and a half away from the um, last delivery, it said zero minutes away. I've never seen the GPS say zero minutes. I've seen it say one minute, which it makes sense. If you're less than one minute, you'll be a few seconds away and it'll be zero minutes. But I've never seen that. That was my first time seeing zero minutes on a GPS in my life. <laughs> I just had to share that. It was weird. I'm like, it says zero minutes, but we ain't even that close yet. We were still a block and a half away and had to go halfway down the street. It's telling me checkers is the hot spot, but I'm going to just drive until something pops up. And I think I just missed the nine fifty one, nine dollars and fifty cents. $9.50. That's what Lonnie was talking about, but I didn't see it when I went back on the app. And I turned my Wi-Fi off because somebody say, do that, like, That'll save your life if you turn Wi-Fi off because you'll miss a lot of deliveries because it'll keep trying to connect to different restaurants you go to, McDonald's and all these places that got free Wi-Fi, and it'll throw it off. I never knew that. Well, this is only my third night doing it, but yeah, I'm trying to learn, honey. Happy Easter! Happy Resurrection Day! He rose on the third day. Yes, it did. Yes, it did, darling. Yes, I hope y'all are having a love, lovely Easter while your girl is out here hustling and trying to make this money. And on that note, we finna go ahead and cue the music and play Rick Ross Hustling one more again while we almost the checkers. I missed the IHOP and the checkers one, y'all. That's what it was. It showed me when I swiped down and looked at my notifications. Y'all, I just accepted a McDonald's one. It said high paid order, but it said six dollars. So I don't know if it's a good tip in there. I don't know. Huh, so here we go. Finna go through the drive thru. You know, your girl gonna try to park in the drive thru and knock on the door if I can. Cause you ain't finna be wasting my gas and it's not even worth it. You know, I'm spending more time and gas than I'm getting paid for the order I'm there for. I just went on ahead and accepted it. So hopefully I didn't see the address that I gotta deliver it to. Maybe I can get back on another side of town or in a different city wherever I'm delivering to and I'll stay over there. So we'll see. 